this video we're going to take a look at how to play Strawberry Fields Forever by the Beatles on acoustic guitar. Now a lot of videos on how to play this go, go on a long time and my aim is to try to get you to be able to learn this one in five minutes. But some of the waffle is, there's two versions of this. There's the famous version which you find on the Magical Mystery Tour album. And because the way the song was recorded it was like almost two takes glued together. The tape's been speeded up slightly so the pitch is altered so that it's difficult to play it along with the record perfectly unless you start tuning your guitar up. For the famous version, the nearest you're going to get to the right pitch is by putting the cap on the first fret. There is the Love Album version which is like a different, like almost like an acoustic take on this one. Cap on the second fret for that one. And you can play along perfectly if you put the cut on the second fret. Uh, but the 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 way it's structured the, of the the song on that version, everything's like almost like the wrong way around. It's still a good version, and it's a decent one to listen to if you're trying this one on acoustic guitar. I'm not going to put the cut one for it, um, and just play it normally. If you want to use the cut one, um, pick the version that that you want to attempt. The intro adapted for acoustic guitar. We're starting off on an A, as you can see on the guitar tab. Going to an E major 7 by dropping down to the 8th fret on G. Dropping down to the 7th fret of G. Essentially we'll take a D. Go down another fret, 4 and 6. Go back up, put our finger down there for an F sharp minor. D ship on the fourth fret for an E, D, A. E. And that's our introduction for the famous version. Actually reached number two in the charts here yeah, in the UK it was the first Beatles single not to go to number one. Yeah, John Lennon viewed it as his best best work. It's interesting little facts. Um, then we come to the chorus. As we finished the intro on A, the cheat sheet that will be in the blog uh, to uh, help you play this one has brackets around A. That is because technically you're not playing A, it runs over. So as you finish. Let me take you down, cause I'm going. And then A minor 7. To strawberry fields. F sharp 7. Nothing is real. To D. And nothing to get. F sharp 7. I'm about D. Strawberry fields for A. Ever. So if I was to include A at the beginning of that chorus. Let me take you down, cause I'm going to strawberry fields. Nothing is real, and there's nothing to get on about. Strawberry fields forever. This is where we play our introduction again uh, for verse one. But then it changes a little bit. So we're going to play. Is easy with eyes closed. It's understanding all we see. I've hardly done at all. Now we'll get a D. We don't change to A. We we'll stick with D. It's getting A hard to be sun A. One when it all works. F sharp minor. Out. D. It doesn't A matter much to D. What we've got there is easy with eyes closed, misunderstanding all you see. It's getting hard to be someone when it all works out. It doesn't matter much to me. Let me take you down. So we're going to chorus two, which is the same. After chorus two, there's a little fill. Which sounds like a sitar. I don't think it's a sitar, but it sounds like one. Like that. You might want to add that in. 
10 to 9. Tenth is B. 12, 9 on G. 12, 11 on D. Twelfth of A. Which is a nice little adding on there. We then come to verse 2. So really you know everything now you need to, to, to know how to play it. Verse 2, which is interesting because on the love version of this, the love album version, this is where the song starts. No one can think, no one I think is in my tree. And we could, it starts off. No. So the song on the love album starts with an E. And I'm playing it E major seven like that. So I've got second, first, and first there. And then go to the E7 like that. That's one way of doing it, and that's if you wanted to play that version of it. Chorus three, verse three, same. Chorus four changes differently at the end, and I'll play that through. Let me take you down, cause I'm going to strawberry fields. Nothing is real, and there's nothing to get on about. Strawberry fields forever. F sharp minor. Strawberry fields forever. Strawberry fields forever. And then goes to here. All the way through. There's a little guitar, electric guitar uh, part, which I'm trying to play on acoustic here, uh, so bear with us. Bend the ninth up. Like that, which is worth noting, but it's that you bend it up and release it. Open air, seventh fret of G, six, seven, six, four, open air. So you should be able to learn this in five minutes. The video is a bit longer than five minutes because we've had a waffle on about where to put the cat or and the differences between the love version and the original version. But as always, thank you for watching and I hope that helps you be able to play Strawberry Fields forever.